Welcome back one and all to another heavy metal news snack. Now I know you're thinking to yourself, Shane, that looks like Blackie Lawless's younger brother Marvin Lawless, but it's not. It is actual, uh, actually the new guitar player, but the nitro guitar player, Mikel Angelo Batillo. And apparently Joey DeMeo uh, has played a bass solo recently and it is, it's controversial. As you can see right here in the readings of the words, it says Man of War guitarist Michael Angelo Batillo addresses controversy over Joey DeMeo's bass playing. So he's laid down his all. We're going to look at a taste of this and see what the deal is. I don't want to get too much into the controversy because this guy is a, he's a guitar playing maniac. Look at this. If you don't know who this is, this, look at that. Can you play a guitar like that? Usually one hand's doing the, the picadill, picadillos, and the other hand's doing the noodling. This guy says, no, both my hands do noodling. And you're saying, Shane, um, so what? It's two guitars. You should see him. He's got another guitar that's got four necks. There's two other guitars that go down this way, and he plays a solo on that. So this guy, Marvin Lullis, you know, not Marvin Lullis, but looks a lot like Marvin Lullis, um, uh, he knows what he's talking about, but I wanted to read a bit of this and then watch a piece of uh, Joey DeMeo, you know, singer, uh, songwriter extraordinaire for Manowar. Um, in the two and a half minute video below, new Manowar guitarist Mikel Angelo Batillo uh, responds to the controversy about Joey DeMeo's bass playing technique as seen in his solo during Manowar's show in Mexico. Michelangelo and Joey's warm-up shredding in the studio. Okay, there is a video of that. We're not watching any of that. Michelangelo addresses comments arguing that Joey is playing guitar, not bass. Talks about Joey's piccolos. See, I called them piccadillos, but they're piccolos. Bass. Joey's piccolo bass and explains how Joey, uh, Joey's and Michelangelo's styles differ from that of many other performers and what that means for their brutal and lightning-fast performances. Four months ago, uh, Man o War announced that it had recruited Michael Angelo Batillo. That other guitar player is pretty good too, right? Right here, Evandro Evi Martel, uh, to play for the band's 2023 Crushing the Enemies of Metal tour. The news came in the wake of guitarist uh, Evi Martel's announcement that he was taking a break from touring for a while, for personal reasons, okay. I thought maybe um, they might have moved on. You know, we don't want to talk about what happened to the other guitar player from Man o War, right? Batillo, who will play his first show with Man o War starting February 2023, is a veteran both in the studio and on stage. We've known Michael uh, for many years. Who's this talking? Um... We've known Michael for many years. This must be the Manowar family. For many years and always admired his work, said DeMeo. See, if you just read a little bit, it'll tell you. His technique is astounding. When we invited him to come and jam with us, we played together at the speed of light. Really? You need to bottle that up and sell it to uh, old uh, Neil deGrasse Tyson. Everything fell into place immediately. We're ready for a killer tour. So we got it down here. This is the video where he's explaining whatever he's explaining, but this is the bass solo. First thing I'll say is whammy bar. I didn't know there was a whammy bar. I mean, and I guess a bass, a bass solo is anything you want it to be, right? Sounds like uh, Jack White. That's a guitar solo. Look at how thin that neck is. That almost, and I and I am not a expert on guitars and stuff, so you'll have to get in there and tell me what kind of bass this is. It looks small, but maybe it's because Joey DeMeo is like seven feet tall. That seems extremely thin to me, almost like a banjo neck. Would you agree with that or disagree with that? I need, I need all the bass fiddlemen to get out there.
Oh my god, he can really do those fingers. He's going... He can really... Does he want to battle Ingve Malmstein? I mean, look at that. Look at how thin those strings are. Is that a guitar solo? I've never seen a bass that looks like that. It's still got the four strings though, right? Or is that even more strings? I can't see. Listen. Oh my goodness, this guy. Oh, he's gonna doing the three three angles. Is it crazy that he looks a little bit like Des Kadena? I mean, he's playing like a classical guitar solo right here, isn't he? I know the bass fiddlemen out there are going to have things to say about this. Uh, but to me, that sounds like a guitar solo being played by a bass player. But you can't fault Manowar for anything. They're great, right? I mean, is he really doing that or is he... I feel like... I feel like he knows what he's doing, but he's not performing it. I, I feel like I could do kind of the same thing but he probably knows a little bit more about where you put your little digits on these on the neck necky doodle. Look at that big monster hand. That's a Frankenstein hand on that. Uh, yeah. I mean is that four strings? Five, two, three, four. Yeah. I like how those doors keep opening up, opening and shutting, you know? This is going to be one of those, uh, a bowl is going to come out on stage here in a minute. Olé! I mean, it would make sense they're in Mexico, right? Uh, what say you? Get in the comments below and tell me exactly what you think of that. Um, you know, for, for reasons that we don't want to really go into is, uh, uh we don't want to sit there and watch that whole thing when you can go and see Man o War live and in person. What do you think of that? Was that a bass solo? Get down there and explain to me, uh, if that was a bass solo or it wasn't a bass solo. When I think of a bass solo, I think of something that, uh, Les Claypool might do, something that Cliff Burton might do, something that, uh, uh, Rudy Sarzo would do with a lot of licking and touching and poking and grabbing on the bass. So you get down there and tell me what you thought of that. And get down there and tell me what you think of Manowar. You can't go wrong with Manowar, right? Swing it out. I've been, I've been fighting the bass. I've been fighting the bass. I've been, I've been fighting the bass. I've been fighting.